Evening troopers and troopesses. Unless troopers are gender neutral, who cares? I'm fat, but that just means there's more of me to cordle up to. I wanted to show you something tonight. I don't know where you've seen them. I didn't see them in proper shops. I only saw them in like cheap shops, but I really like them. Have you seen? I think they're called box battlers or something. The Star Wars. So they're wicked. And it's like little battle scenes from Star Wars. Tiny. In like a little foldy up cube. That I'm making a right mess of. See, it's just a little cube, eh? Cube, is that the right terminology? And then you fold it open. And you've got a little battle scene. And how adorable. Genuinely adorable is that. You've got your exhaust ports, about two metres. X-Wing, oh, perspective. X-Wing, T-65, Incom. It's my Starfighter choice. I, 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 I dallied with the T-47s, but T-65s are the best. Little TIE Fighters, got a twin ion engine. Just so adorable, so adorable. So that one is, the, is Luke's Trench Battle. Okay, that's cool. This one is the Battle of Endor. The Battle of Endor, look! It's got a little sc a scout trooper. There's Ewoks, catapults, trees, and then at the back there, it's not very well made, but the bunker. You see the bunker? What you don't have is, you know that bit where that Ewok dies and his mate's like, come on! And he's like, no, I'm dead youth. And he's like, Duke, oh no! And he has a little cry in that. Remember the Fallen of Endor. So that's adorable. Uh, this one is the uh, escape through the asteroid field after the uh, Hoth battle. So you've got the aluminum. My favourite thing is the aluminum falcon. And you've got some more TIE fighters, A's. And you've got some asteroid A's. And, and, and stars. And that's all spacey. And that folds up into a little box. More or less. Uh... The Battle of Hoth itself, you got the you got the shield generator, the power generators there. You got a you got a snow speeder, a couple of attacks. There's I think that's supposed to be a probe droid. I think, and then a couple of gun turrets. Look, it's adorable, isn't it? Oh, they love I love them. I love them. Uh, and then the last one, Geonosis. But you know you've got your you've got your, your, your gunship and you've got your APT and you've got your Trade Federation ships and you've got your your droid your, like the rocket droid. Do you ever used to play? You know the original Battlefront on PS2. And you're like and you're in the carbon freezing chamber and you've just murdered everyone and you have got like flashing health at the bottom and you're like what is coming out? You you like you've just obliterated it. And then the guy comes over and says, we've captured the carbon freezing chamber. Oh, have we? We've just done that, have we? Because <laughs> you're going to laugh, but it looks like I've just done that on my own. Quick flashback there to Battlefront on the original PlayStation. If you don't know, get to know. Um, so yeah, Geonosis. Now, there's a final extra special one that I've been keeping till last. And this one's a super size, super size. I'm a super size kind of guy. Yeah, all right, we know. This is, again, the Battle of Death Star 1, but it's huge. Um, and it's got um, Vader's in TIE Advance there. Caught the TIE Fighters. You got the old X-Wing there a lot. I don't know whether, oh, that does something. You know, I think this is supposed to be a game. I think there's a game you can play, but I just like looking at them as objects. A little Y-Wing. Y-Wing? Why? Y-Wing! Uh, and of course the... Uh, oh, I can't remember what's that called. I've never mentioned that shit before. Uh, and then the Death Star one that pops explode. Oh, I know what you do. You pop that in and then you go... And Yeah. What's supposed to happen is the whole thing's like pops up. But I haven't a clue what I'm doing because I'm thick as mints. So that's that. I really like them. And I think I got them for like, well, I got them from Pound Stretcher well before uh, Toys R Us went under. Um, 
And they all, the last thing to tell you about them is they all lock together. Except the big one. But they all, they all interlock. So you can have like rolling landscapes and they all stick together. I really love them. I really love them. I really like the Hoth one. But I think my favourite is the Death Star Trench. That is, that is amazing, isn't it? That would make a nice watch. I haven't got my watch on at the moment. But like I have it as a cube, and then somebody says, "Hey, Toby, watch the time," and I'm like, "I don't know. Check this." And you're like, "Oh, it's skin past bone." And they're like, "That's the Death Star trench run, but it's a watch." I'm like, yeah, that's how cool I am. Death Star trench. I um, hope you enjoyed the video. I did a video the other day about my Funko Pops. Didn't get many views because I didn't promote it as well as I normally do. So if you haven't seen that, check that out as well. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, hit subscribe and like. Somebody keeps putting dislikes on. What is there to dislike about me? I am adorable. And I've also put you on like a stand now so you're not getting regret fat man shakes. So. I'll come back at the weekend with another video, if I can think of something good to do. And in the meantime, may the force be with you.